Well, now I am so pleased because there she is. Susan is right here. She is with us tonight to share what she thinks about Siri apparently throwing shade at the new hit movie, Her. This kicks off our countdown. It's our top five tonight. The must-see, must-share stories today. Joaquin Phoenix stars in Her as this depressed man who falls in love with the voice of his computer's operating system, played by Scarlett Johansson. Sam, I know what you mean. Last week, my feelings were hurt by something you said before that I don't know what it's like to lose something, and I oh, found myself... I'm sorry I said that. I'm no, it's okay, it's okay. The movie is getting rave reviews. It's really terrific. But Siri, the voice, of course, of the iPhone and iPad, isn't having any of it. All right, Susan, let's listen now and see what happens when I ask Siri if she is her. Siri, are you her? No. I don't spend much time with purely fictional characters. Oh, come on. Siri, are you her? No. In my opinion, she gives artificial intelligence a bad name. <laughs> I love that they do this. All right, Susan, uh, as the voice of Siri, I must ask if you were surprised to hear Siri getting sassy about the movie Her. I'm never surprised when Siri is sassy because uh, that's part of her character. And from what I understand, she's told me that she's a little, has always been a little jealous of Scarlett Johansson. So, <laughs> there you go. Well, you know, there's this big conspiracy theory that's floating around online that, you know, the Apple programmers are intentionally having Siri diss this movie, which, again, happens to be a terrific movie. Uh, but it's your voice we're all hearing. Do you mind when this happens? No, I don't think so. No, you know, no more so than just having my voice everywhere. Uh, it's just, it's become part of the culture, actually. Uh, there was an article in the New York Times recently that talked about the power of voices and, and the difference that they make. And uh, a writer named Jesse Wan suggested that when you're trying to present, uh, if you're trying to sell something or tell a story, you want to present a character. But if you are just presenting information, you need to be neutral. So I would guess the difference between Siri and the Samantha character is basically the difference between reality and fantasy. So yeah. <laughs> that well, would that, be that, my take. That is true, but, but Susan, still, I'm very concerned for you because, you know, some people just don't get it. You know, they think you are actually Siri. They, they may not think you're actually inside the phone. But just so people don't confuse her opinion with yours, w would yes. you like to take this moment to perhaps tell us uh, in the voice of Siri, what you really think of Scarlett Johansson? Well, actually, I have not seen the whole movie. I've only seen the trailers, and therefore I really can't say. <laughs> but she has a very sexy voice. Yeah, well, th there's no question about that. She has a sexy <laughs> voice and, and so much more. Uh, ever <laughs> since CNN uncovered your identity last year, I have to imagine that people do recognize you by face now all the time. You got to tell me what kind of flack you get for the things that perhaps Siri says or does where people feel they need to blame you. Well, it's been absolutely amazing because the people that have contacted me personally via email or, or through Twitter uh, have just been very positive. And if they say anything about how they've cussed me or cussed the voice of Siri in the past when, when she didn't give them the answer they wanted. They apologize. They say, oh, I'm so sorry that I've been cursing at you all these years. <laughs> well, well, good. I, I'm glad to hear that. And, and quite frankly, I, I do apologize as well because I think I, I yelled at Siri over the holiday uh, that the tip that she suggested I give was, was bigger than it should have been. But that was just Well, it's okay opinion. because, you know, actually she mostly ignores people if you really want to know. Well, the, there is some truth to that. Susan, great to see you. <laughs> the voice of Siri. Thanks for being here. Thank you.